Hello and welcome to the big picture. It's about 11 months since a massive Puriborthan occurred through the ballot in West Bengal. The people of the state were obviously fed up and fatigued by the 34-year-old rule of the left front that they yearned and brought about the change which the Trinamool Congress chief Mamta Banerjee promised. Is she living up to this promise? What has changed in Bengal? How come we continue to hear about political atrocities now apparently by the ruling Trinamool cadres against the left front party cadres? Some of the recent decisions of Mamta Banerjee, like asking libraries not to keep several mainstream newspapers, or a cadre attacking a professor for mailing a cartoon, or the chief minister barging into police stations to rescue her party cadre, not to mention her whimsical decision to get Trinish, Dinesh Trivedi removed from the union cabinet. Have all this led to people not only in Bengal, but also across the country asking, is this the paribartan that Bengal needs? We are therefore looking into all this today and asking the question, is Bengal heading towards, if I can coin a new word, whimsicracy? To discuss this, I have with me an interesting panel of guests. Here in the studio with me is Nilotpal Basu, Central Committee member of the CPIM, Sudhir Tailang, a well-known cartoonist, and Atanu Bhattacharya, Chief of Bureau in Delhi of Bartman, a leading Bengali newspaper, and will also be joined on the phone line from Kolkata by D. Bandopadhyay, the Rajya Sabha member of the Trinamool Congress, as well as Shiva Prasanna, the renowned artist who is also a staunch supporter of Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee. Welcome to all my guests. Let me first go to Mr. Bandopadhyay. Yes, please. Mr. Bandopadhyay, you know, yes. the, the recent decisions, several of the decisions, several of the happenings in West Bengal, you know, have it is 11 months now. I think the honeymoon period of Mamta Banerjee and your, and your government in West Bengal is over. Lot of questions are being asked. The latest is about this cartoon controversy. So, you think that your government is, you know, has got a little derailed? No, no, no. I think it's a complete misinformation is spreading all throughout. Number one, there is no cartoon. Cartoon is a drawing by drawing, drawing. But here it is a collage of, uh, of certain wrong pictures for a defaming, defaming, and scandalously done to defame Monta Banerjee and the new railway minister Mukul Roy. There is right. no cartoon involved in it. No, it, okay, Mr. Bandopadhyay. Mr. Bandopadhyay, cartoon, yes. cartoonists are creative. They sometimes use photographs. They sometimes use, um, you know, sketches. But you are saying that it is it, it is scandalous. What is What has been published is scandalous, right? No. Point is, the matter has been blown out of proportion. Okay. If somebody, and it is a, what has happened is largely an internal quarrel in a, in a private poverty society in which there are two parties. One party is taking advantage and to have revenge on the other. Right. In which this has been brought in. Right. It is a very minor point and this is nothing to do with Mamta Banerjee. Mamta Banerjee is not but, the uh, Thanedar of Jalapur police station. Absolutely. But, so but, but, what but, but, has, what but, has been done at the very lowest level has nothing to do with Mamta Banerjee. But Mr. Bandopadhyay, it's a fact that the, your chief minister has defended the action of the police against the professor. Say, and she has also said that such things should not be done. Only good things should be published in newspapers. These are all but very bad simple things. simple reason, the matter has gone to the court. Whether it is correct or incorrect, the okay. court will decide. Okay. So, okay, you please. Level. Right, right, Mr. Bandopadhyay. Please stay on. I'll come back to you. Uh, let me come to you, Sudhir. You cartoonists are in, seems to be in uh, great danger nowadays. Absolutely. See, my hand is broken. <laughs> <laughs> but not broken by Mamta Banerjee. <laughs> what happened? You know, uh, let me tell you that India is a democracy. Like many democracies, the art of cartooning has flourished in India. And only in no, democracies very, you have political no, it's cartoonists. It's very interesting that they are saying it's not a cartoon. It's I'll, I'll explain it to you. Yeah. I'll explain it to you. See, what has happened is that only in democracies political cartooning has flourished. Right. Russia, China... Most of the dictatorships, cartooning, political cartooning has not flourished. Social cartooning still has in China. For, right. for that. But are we China? India is a democracy which has a history of 64 years of freedom in this country. Constitution of India provides complete freedom to the press and free expression. 
Now, Pandit Nehru, when he was launching Shankar's weekly for uh, Shankar in 1948, right. Right. he said, don't spare me, Shankar. Here is a politician now who is saying, don't even touch me. Right. I'll teach you a lesson. This is what Mamata Banerjee the latest, said. The latest we have heard is that Facebook, you know, the CID, the state CID has yes. approached Facebook and saying that, you know, all those things which are you know, this is, about this Mamata Banerjee should be removed. This is paranoia, actually. This is paranoia. In a free press, I think political cartooning, if it is not satirical, if it is not offensive, see, it's a negative art. Right. It's an art of offense. It's right. an art of protest. Right. We play the role of the opposition yes. to both the government and to the opposition. Right. In general, to the establishment. About this cartoon, uh, uh, this gentleman was saying yes. that this cartoon is not even a cartoon. Okay, yes. I agree completely with him, it's not a cartoon. It's a graphic. It has got some photographs. Right. Nowadays, what has happened is that a lot of people cannot draw. Mm. They use photographs. Right. The professor may not be a good artist. He has used some captions. But is this... No, he has not done it. Is somebody, this, somebody else, somebody else has done it. Yeah. But is this offensive? Is this pornographic? Does it insult anybody? I don't think. It's a most harmless and innocent cartoon. And it doesn't offend anybody. If even this cartoon offends Mamta Banerjee and, and it offends so much that she is so worked up that she arrests the minister, I mean this, this professor, professor, I think uh, then the days of me, people like me are numbered in <laughs> okay. this country. Okay, I don't think, Sudhir, you, do, you have to be worried about that. But anyway, let me come to uh, Nilodpal. Nilodpal, uh, you know, all this must be sounding like music to your ears, all that is happening because, because you know, after, after 11 months, things seems to be really go going out of hand. But people people say, and people are now probably f fondly recalling your days, though there are, I'm sure there'll, there'll be many critics who still feel uh, offended with several other things which your party had done when, the, when it was in power. But coming to these issues, what has happened in, uh, happening in West Bengal, cartoon arresting of the, the cartoonist, I don't know who is the cartoonist. The problem is, who is the cartoonist? We don't know. But this professor has been arrested. You people seem to be underplaying the whole thing. No, it's not a question of underplaying. First of all, uh, it is not music to my ears. Because uh, as much as uh, Sudhir Telang, I am also a citizen of this country and I value uh, uh, citizens' freedom as much as he does. So, this turn of events in Bengal is really very sad. More so because, you see, Bengal has a very, very rich intellectual and creative tradition. Right. Some of the finest literatures of uh, Bengal have uh, produced uh, humor. Right. And one of the leading lights is uh, Satyajit Roy's uh, father, Sukumar Roy. Right. And if you see today Facebook generated uh, and material generated from Bengal, you will find huge reproductions of Sukumar Rai's. Uh, and both Sukumar Rai and Satish Tari did cartoons also. And, yes. And yes. incidentally, them were big cartoons. and this is also an interpretation of, of. from that classic film, Sonar Kella Sonar by Satyajit Roy. Right. So, so in the land of uh, Satyajit Roy or Sukumar Roy, uh, Tagore, yes. and so many others I can name, this is happening. This is uh, really, really very, very sad. You see, I don't say that uh, we did not make, commit any mistake whatsoever during our 34-year uh, stay. There in were there were several instances but, of such intolerance. But not a single instance can be shown where this kind of attack on individual freedom or press freedom had happened. You see, you were mentioning that uh, uh, direction to government-funded, government-aided libraries. Now, can you think of we will, we will Bortoman, no, no. Bortoman, we will, we will, which is we will, so critical of the we will, we will, Ananda Bajar. I no, mean, we, will we will come to that. We will come to that issue. I want uh, uh, Atanu's views on this. Atanu, uh, Nilodpal says that during their periods, these kind of things never happened. Attack on individual freedoms and things like that. They, they may be debatable. I'm sure there will be people who will, who will uh, argue about it with him. But now what is happening? How do you see this whole uh, issue on, on the, on, as far as the cartoon is concerned? See, it is also related to some you know, housing society issue and this has been used actually. Yeah, there are some political twists to the entire incident. And uh, first of all, 
I think the government of West Bengal and Chief Minister of West Bengal, Mamata Banerjee and Trinamool Congress, they have overreacted to the issue. Right. They should have, you know, underplayed it. They should have ignored it. Cartoons are cartoons. Even if it is a cartoon or a collage, they should have ignored it. Or and a it, and, and the charge which is brought against the professor right. that he has outraged the modesty, modesty. of a woman. Mm. I yes. mean, how come this charge Outrage of outraging, in, outraging in, the in, modesty of yeah. a woman <laughs> is involved here <laughs> is beyond anybody's guess. But having said that, I mean, whatever they had done during left front regime, the attack was much more institutionalized, much more organized. It may not be an attack on an individual, individual, but the attack was on the system, right. on the freedom of the entire system. system. Here the attack is against an individual. They are picking up an individual here or an individual there. Why? Because there are some local political elements involved in it, which is coming to light. There are some real estate syndicate, right. those syndicates are involved supply of you know uh, building materials yes. they're involved in that particular syndicate industry the cpm has a very long entrenched interest okay he may deny it but it is i mean as a well-known fact open secret that cpm used to dominate because they were ruling the state for last 34 years right. now their power has gone and there are some internal rivalries within the cpm there are some factions factional fights in that particular area in that district and some of them and Trinomil is also, you know, riven with internal dissensions. Neo neophyte Trinomuls who have come from other parties and joined Trinomul for lust of power, and they are trying to settle scores with original Trinomuls, old Trinomuls, and this is the fight, and everyone is trying to take advantage of the situation, mm -hmm. and Chief Minister is made acting some, out of proportion. Absolutely. You made some very, very interesting and important points. We'll, we'll discuss that, but meanwhile, I have, uh, we have on the phone line with us uh, Shiva Prasanna, a very well-known artist and a staunch supporter of Mamta Banerjee. Uh, Mr. Shiva Prasanna, welcome. Can you hear me? Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, Mr. Shiva Prasanna, the, the discussion is, you know, started, starts with the cartoon, but you know, cartoon or whatever you call it. Mr. Bandhupadhyay, who is also on the phone line with us, the Trinamool Congress MP, he says that it's not a cartoon, it's a graphic or it's a photograph or whatever, whatever it is. You as an artist, I am sure, understands that nowadays there are various ways of doing these things. So you think no, no, that it is, it is really pity. No, no. I'm, I let me really let, let me let me let me yeah. finish my question, Mr. Shiv Prasad. Now let me finish my question. Do you think that Mamta Banerjee, as well as the uh, the government of West Bengal, has overreacted in this case? Not at all. Not at all. You see, the thing is, some people deliberately trying to malign. Uh, uh, her as well as West Bengal, because uh, uh, she is uh, uh, trying uh, and, 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 and working very, very hard, right. almost 24 hours. And after so many years, communist government, right. uh, who completely destroyed Bengal, Bengal culture, inter infrastructure, everything. Right. Now, there, is, there are still allies, you know, they are trying to... Uh, a malign, different way. It's, it's a, it's a mal malignant uh, problem. So, Mr. Pras Shiva so, Prasanna, so, uh, no, it, it, is, is, it is not at all. It's not, uh, not at all true. Mr. Pras because the real situation is not that bad. No, no, it is not a question that of that bad. In this case, Mr. Shiva Prasanna, a professor who had innocently mailed, you know, which we all do, we all forward these kind of things all the time. People are doing it. Now, you know, this kind of uh, terrorizing people for doing something which is no, so no, innocent think, and which people can... That, is, it, is, is it just simple innocency? You it is, what, it is, it what is do you only think? one evidence. Uh, since a couple of, couple of weeks, uh, these people are trying to malign this way. <coughs> this is not cartoon. Everybody, no, so many no, wise no, people no. also... Mr. Shivaprasanna... Uh, cartoon. cartoon is a completely different thing. That is an art. Believe Mr. me, Mr. Prasanna, uh, uh, Mr. No, Mr. No, Mr. Prasanna, Mr. we have Sudhir Thailand, the cartoonist here in the studio with us. He would like to. He would like to. No, he would like to. No, he would like to. He would like to react. No relation with cartoon. Okay, and, and let me. Photography. Mr. Mr. Shiv Prasanna, let uh, Sudhir Thailand react to it, Sudhir. 
See, Mr. Shwa Prasanna, you are an artist. I have, yes. a, I have great regard for you. I actually respect a, a lot your art. I'm really surprised to know that you're supporting a dictatorial move by the chief minister just because no, no, you support no, no, her. No, 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 You are a cartoonist. You are doing something with your line, sensitive line. No, but it hardly but makes a difference whether I do it, it with it line or whether I do it by... cartoon. No, no, please listen to me. Completely, completely... Mr. Shah please. Dirty, dirty please picture. listen to me. Mr. We are trying to, trying to uh, uh, use some politics. So please listen to me. There is a... I'm saying... Mr. Shah Prasanna... I'm saying... Mr. Shah led... Mr. President, I have a very small question. Sudhir, Sudhir I am saying that. Why, as a, as a, as a, as let a Sudhir finish. As, as a creative person, there you can are be. Acting that. <laughs> Democracy is not that. Prasanna, Shwa Prasanna, see, the thing is that. If I am to, if I, I try Mr. to. Mr. Prasanna, we will. Mr. Prasanna, Mr. Prasanna, please, react. please allow, please allow Sudhir Thailand to say what he wanted to say. What I mean to say, Mr. Shiva Prasanna, is that. There can be a thousand ways to express your feelings, your views, your ideas. You can express it through a painting, you can express through a collage, you can express through a small short film, through a dance performance, through anything, or through a cartoon. It hardly makes a difference but the, yes, if yes, the medium changes. So, yeah, okay. okay. And I hardly find it's anything I'm, offensive I'm in it. Okay, Sudhir. I, I, Mr. Shiv Prasanna, Mr. Shiv Prasanna, I'll come back to you. I need to, I need to, Mr. Shiv Prasanna, I need to go. I need to go into a short break now. Please, please stay on. I'll come back to you. Please keep watching. We'll be back very soon. Welcome back. We are looking at the situation in West Bengal and asking the question, is West Bengal becoming a whimsicracy, a whimsical democracy? So, uh, Mr. Bandhubadhyay, Atanu Bhattacharya raised some very, very important and crucial issues. Who, who, I couldn't get it, please. At Atanu, Atanu Bhattacharya, the Chief of Bureau of Bartman, who is there in the studio with us today, hmm. Atanu has raised a very important issue. He said, that this is just not about cartoons or you know other things which have happened about newspapers or whatever. This is about well entrenched interests in both of the uh, of the left front. Now you your people are trying to dismantle them and take over certain certain you know, in all no. areas. Point is, I heard Mr. Nilapal Basu saying, but does Nilapal Basu explain why did in his type of period? 55,619 political murders took place. Could he explain why 72,600 political rapes took place? This is an organized violence against civil society and the opponents that he did throughout 34 years. Now we are living this uh, era of liberty. So Mr. Bandhubadi, there is, there is the... nothing all on a organized violence anywhere. So if there is a particular aberration of a particular person, it is going to go to the court. It is no one has taken him to anything else. Whether the court is whether it is right or wrong, the court will decide. Mr. Bandho Padhyay, Mr. Then, Bandho, you will get a right. No, no, it's not. No, it's not just that. Okay, you, I mean, you, you gave some numbers about the, you know, uh, about I, I murders. Have and, number and, they, I have okay. published the number and they, right, right. they did no, not uh, contest it during, uh, during their uh, No, those reign. numbers. Let us, let us, let us, no, political murders. Mr. Mr. Bandhubadhyay, please listen to me. 600 political rape Mr. as an Band instrument of political domination. Okay, Mr. Bandhubadhyay, now the question is, because we have started hearing about similar things happening in, very, in various parts of West Bengal. So is the, is the Paribartan all about revenge? The point is, it is a fact that there is a large-scale incursion of some old CPIM cadre coming into Trinomul as a new, new Trinomuli. And there is a, they're trying to take over the Trinomul organization by subterfuge. So it is. Something is going on. I don't deny that. But the fact is, it is an organized mission of the left, uh, of the left particularly the CPIM, 
to destabilize the situation okay. by creating an uh, let me, internal let, dissension absolutely. among the Trinamool party. Absolutely. Let, let, me, let, me, let me get, uh, get Mr. Nilotpal Basu's views on this. Nilotpal yes, Basu, 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 subterfuge. They're saying that, you know, it's, it's you people are now indulging in subterfuge. You see, paranoia is very dangerous. And in West Bengal, it has assumed the proportion of an epidemic. And uh, even an uh, otherwise sane person like Mr. Bandavadhyay is affected. <laughs> I don't join issues with him because it is so ugly that uh, since the Chief Minister is saying that we will better the record of uh, 34 years in one year itself. So the numbers he was rattling out, I don't know from where he has gathered, that they will better that record uh, in 11 months time, if uh, that is the kind of logic and I don't go into that. My simple question is whether like other parts of the country, citizens of West Bengal, irrespective of political opinion, will, can enjoy the uh, human rights and the personal freedom that is enshrined in the Indian constitution. Let Why I say this? Yes. Why I say this? Because not only uh, the, the fatigue and uh, quote unquote what you said, there was a uh, slogan which was coined by the Trinamool Congress and all their allies that we are for change yes. and not vendetta. Badla nahi badal Bad dalo. Okay. Mr. Bandhupadhyay, can you hear me? Uh, yes, yes. Okay. You can you? To that to me or to yes. Yeah, you can answer this question. The vendetta no, no. politics. That is, just Mr. Basu said there is a vendetta. Yes. Tell me the number of killings that was done during the CPIM. I gave the figure, exact figure. 55,619 political murders. He thinks the figure, figure has no basis. Rape. What is this? What will happen in the last uh, uh, okay, 11 years? Uh, 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 nothing. The nothing has happened. We can have that. Okay. But today we Mr. are discussing so something else. Absolutely. Mr. What Mr. is it? We are breathing for the first time. Mr. Bandhupadhyay. Mr. Bandhupadhyay. Since this party completely talking the voice of the people. That's what they did. People could not come out of terror. So you think... Now there is a free movement everything. Mr. Bandhupadhyay. Mr. Bandhupadhyay. Now you please tell me, Chief Minister orders the state libraries not to keep certain newspapers. How do you, why, you know, whether, whether how can this happen in a, in a state where not, ordinary in people CPM need to read all the newspapers? Me, in CPM's time, they did not allow any other newspaper excepting Gavashakti in any state library. That's any right. any other newspaper. Ask That's Mr. Right. Sunil for that. Let me 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 was, was it the case, as Mr. Bandhupadhyay is saying, that during the CPM rule only uh, Ganeshakti was uh, available in the state libraries and not other newspapers? No, I don't think so. I mean, CPM might have threatened our paper, might have, uh, you know, put some impediments, professional impediments, but they have never stopped the subscription of any newspaper in a, any state-aided library. Yeah. I don't remember any such incident. And if that is the case, what Mr. D. Bandhupadhyay is saying, that they had done so, so we so are doing <laughs> it. So it brings, that is the, uh, that is the, <laughs> this is the politics of vendetta. And if CPM had or left front had committed a political harakiri, that doesn't, you know, make, I mean, give them any give license them. to... Absolutely. Commit another Mr. harakiri. I think I, the same I, I, I think I have Shiv, Mr. Shivprasanna on the line. Mr. Shivprasanna, last words to you. Yeah. Politics of vendetta seems to be that. That is what uh, you know. Uh, some of the guests here in the studio is also saying. Mm -hmm. See, in the case of newspaper, you stop newspapers, and then Mr. Bandhupadhyay is saying that CPM did not allow other newspapers, so we will not, also not allow newspapers. No, no, you know, is not, this not kind of is this the kind you are, you are, of change? You are, from, you are you are you are discussing from distance. It is it is. Uh, you know, uh, since couple of couple of weeks, uh, some sort of motivated people they are trying to malign, they are trying to uh, uh, character 
assassination to really? uh, 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 some people. So this is the uh, result of all these things. No, Mr. Ban actual, Mr. Actual, Mr. Actual, uh, actual situation is not that. No, Mr. Shiv Prasanna. to Ms. encourage uh, new journalists. She is trying to encourage new newspapers. How do you? That's all. How, how do you? How do you also? How do you explain? The government's decision to keep marks and angels out of the school school curriculum, Mr. Shiv Prasanna. Who told you? Who told you? It is all 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 wrong news. Okay. It's, it's so all, you mean all 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 actually uh, uh, spreading very bad way. So you are not not true. It is not not the decision of education uh, ministry. So it will continue. So are Marx, you saying that very, Marx is very much there? Acha, Marx is very much. Okay, okay. That is, that is a good reassurance. Uh, for a lot of people. Thank you. We have completely run short of time. My last words will give to Sudhir Thailang. Mm. Sudhir, you know, mm. uh, all these things, you, you earlier made a remark that, you know, yeah. democracy is at stake. Absolutely. Huh? Huh. But isn't it too early to, to come to such a conclusion? No, no, I'm not coming to, I'm just uh, saying something. I'm a cartoonist, I exaggerate things. Yeah. The thing is that I remember, uh, you know, <laughs> when Mr. M.M. M. Joshi, used to be a uh, HRD minister. One day I got a telephone call from his office. His PA said that, that Dr. Joshi is very angry with you. The mm. minister is very angry. I spoke to him on the phone. I said, why are you angry? I haven't done anything on you. Mm. He says, I'm angry because you haven't drawn any cartoon on me for the last six months. <laughs> this is it. If you appear in cartoons, you are in business of politics. Yes. If you're not in cartoons, which means you're finished, Mamta Didi should learn to laugh at herself. She's a very good cartoon character. <laughs> I mean, I love drawing her. She shouldn't stop her from drawing okay. her. And so, there are a lot of politicians who love cartoons. LK is one. Even see, uh, our election absolutely. commissioner, Mr. Kurashi, he loves his cartoons. TN Session used to love his cartoons. Je, uh, Atunu, Atunu, last words to you. Mm -hmm. You think the state, the kind of paribartan which was promised, you think it is anywhere near that paribartan? You think, you think still things can change? I mean, that uh, you cannot compare 11 months rule with a 34 years regime. So you have to give her some more time. Right. I think even his party secretary, Mr. Biman Basu, he had said in a recent interview that they wanted to give some more time to Mamata Banerjee. The time for the judgment is yet to come. Okay. So we have time to wait and watch. Time for judgment is yet to come, but there are a lot of warning signals that there is a lot of whimsical decisions being taken in, in West Bengal by the chief minister. So there is no doubt about it that a lot of people are getting concerned about it. A lot of intellectuals and friends who had supported Mamata Banerjee throughout the ca her campaign are also feeling disappointed. So this should act as a warning signal to the Trinamool Congress so that they can still restore and give the real parivartan that they spoke <coughs> about. Thank you very much for watching. Thanks to all my guests, Mr. Shiva Prasanna, Mr. Bandhopadhyay, Nilotpal Basu, Atunu Bhattacharya and Sudhir Thailang. Please keep watching. We'll come back with another issue on the big picture.